<laughs> yeah, they want to see the Honda as well. Jeez. What do you think? Yeah, good? Yeah, good. Hello. Whoa, oh, he touched my hand. I wanted to introduce the car, but um, we've got a bit of an audience. All right. <laughs> so, how are you doing, guys? So, back again. So, yeah, finally, I bought, I don't know, it's probably like my 15th Honda Civic. I don't know what's wrong with me. You know when you say you buy the last one, but you buy another one. Basically, I bought this. I'm just going to do an OEM Plus build on it for the channel. This is going to be part one. We've got some cool bits for the car. So it's sort of um, OEM Plus bits. But what is it? Um, Jesse says in Fast and Furious, we've put 15 grand into it and decimate all. I think we've put about 15 into it and it'll still be slow. But <laughs> let's see what happens. You've got a bit of an audience. And Danny. Danny's hiding in the background again as usual. All right, guys, so the reason I bought this one is basically, well, I wouldn't say any Civic's rust-free, but it's basically rust-free. Um, but yeah, we basically got it. If you have a look at it, all the arches, we pulled the rubber off. They've actually got all the spot welds still. But I'm going to roll the arches anyway, just so I get that fitment I like. But it's just cool to see that the arches aren't rotten out really bad. Obviously, they've got a little bit there and just done this, so I can just do some basic spot repairs. Same again on this side. It's a bit crustier on that section there, but they said if you pull it all off, it's in pretty good condition, man. So I'm pretty happy with that. So we've got another Civic we're using as a donor car and we're just taking the bits off it. I've just taken out the B18C4 out of the other Civic, which you'll see in the clips. Uh, this is a D14, well, I can't see it on there, but it's a D14A4 and it's an EJ9. Uh, so basically yeah, we're just gonna take everything out, put the B18C4 in with the S80 box and just make it into a nice OEM plus build. So what I'll do is I'll still paint the engine bay, sort of rust out on the top of here, because it's only on the top. But like I said, look all the chassis legs and everything, they're in really good condition. Strut tops are really good. I'm just like buzzing about it. We're taking the airbox off to just get a bit of some wantons. Um, <laughs> the battery trays are seen better days, but we got a spare one off the other Civic. So yeah, man, it's pretty sick. I'm like really buzzing about it, to be honest. But yeah, the, the interior is just sort of basic, pretty standard. Um, Pretty good condition, man. Obviously, these are the seats out of the other one as well. So these are EK4 seats. And then we're going to put the EK4 dashboard in, uh, dials in as well. And just sort of tidy up the door cards. Yeah, so there's not too much I can say about this one. It's obviously got the sunroof. A lot of people prefer them without the sunroof because they're lighter. But yeah, it's box standard, man. I don't think anything's been done on it apart from a sticker in the window. Um, we changed the bonnet because I took the better bonnet off the donor car. So we use that as well off of another donor car. So that's pretty cool. Yeah, we just want to, I want to make it OEM Plus because as a kid, I stripped all my Civics out, no interiors, and then as you get a bit older, they got horrible to drive, do you know what I mean? So I just keep them for like weekends or track days or actually I want to, yeah, I'm sort of racing. But yeah, we'll keep this one OEM Plus and if we can, I said, I think you've got to have quite a bit of following to do like a raffle. So if we get to maybe raffle it off or sell it or I'd like to keep it, but to be honest, I want to build cars for the channel and let, let someone enjoy them basically. All right, guys, so this is the donor car that we got off my friend John. It's got like the Honda confetti seats in front and, and rear. We've just took out the EK4 clocks as well. So yeah, it's gonna be pretty sick, man. I, I reckon we gotta basically take off all the good parts for this one and we can make a good one out of the pair. Yeah, as you can see, I've cut the arches off just to inspect it. And I'm just tired of doing so many arches now inside out. So I just wanted to get a better shell. And you can see it's quite bad inside out. 
But the thing is, like most of these Hondas, it's got really good points and really bad points. Yeah, the guys are just dropping all the little components out. You got Mikey, Chrissy just watching, Danny, and yeah. So this is a B18C4 with a S80 box. Um, it's pretty clean to be fair, like, but it's just the strut tops are nice in this engine bay. But as you look down here, all the radiator mounts and everything are like crusty. Oh, who snapped the bolt then? <laughs> is that my bro? Just go a bit careful with it. <laughs> all right, so yeah, we gotta get some new bolts. Sorry, right, Mike, pay for that. That's all good. It's all good. Now we got the half port mounts and everything. Basically, we're gonna clean everything up as much as we can before it goes into the other car. I just want to tidy up, paint the rocker cover and just keep all the best bits. We'll probably put new coilovers in it, but it's got Mista R coilovers as well. Yeah, we've got loads of little bits. I'm probably just, like I said, all these bits here, I'm probably gonna put new ones on there anyway. I don't wanna use any old stuff. We've got the, the whale ding -a -ling as well. Danny's breaking his back. To be honest, he wants to keep all the bits for his own Civic, but we'll just keep an eye on him. Just check his pockets. Yeah. What is that in your pocket? Oh, I'm keeping that now. Take his shoes as well. Take his shoes. Mate, I'll tell you to put these on. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. So yeah, just um, honestly, I don't know. D series. Danny's just pulling the loom through. Oh, you done it properly. I'm so at least Mike, Mike didn't do it. He would have chopped the loom. Oh god, both plugs. Oh, oh, he took he took off one plug. Oh, I shouldn't talk too oh, much. Actually, I haven't done anything yet. I'm uh, cleaning the workshop. So Mike's done all the easy work. Lying down. 